everybody okay so today I'm back with an actual hair haul video um it's a new year I'm gonna promise to myself to wear my natural hair um for the whole year without flat ironing without flat ironing it yes straightening it or um putting heat to it as far as direct heat with the blow dryer or whatnot so um I picked up a few products that are oldie spaghettis um, years ago, when I first went natural, I was like a product junkie. Couldn't tell me nothing. I had everything under the sink. Anybody said something about transitioning products or oils or creams or pomades, I had it in my possession. Um, last year, I went through all of that. And then, as you can see, that little rack is gone. I put another garment rack up. As far as that really big uh, cart tier thingy, I had. Stop fixing my. Okay. That little cart thing I had full of products, makeup, clothes, bags, whatever. I did a clean sweep. I have four big garbage bags full of stuff. I'm going to take the Buffalo Exchange. Um, I'm, I, I doubt I pick anything else up. Probably just get the cash for it, whatever, whatever or whatnot. But, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with the products that I picked up. Um, First thing I picked up was some more shea butter. And I got the small size. It was at my local beauty supply store. And it came crumpled up like this. And I'm like, what kind of shea butter is this? Did they mix it with something? It smells like shea butter, but we'll see. I'm suspect on that. That's why I got the look for small size. And it was only $3, so I picked it up. Then I picked up some more Elastic QP olive oil mango butter. And it's $6.99 at my beauty supply store. And this is really good for a twist out. Yeah, for twist outs. And it's not that great of a moisturizer for me. That's why I picked up the um, Commit Biologics, but it it does its job, and it's on the ground, and I like products that I can get on the ground. Um, moving on to some products I ordered online. I ordered some more Jamaican Black Castor Oil for my temples. As you can see, it's actually starting to grow back, um, my natural hair. I shed for postpartum shedding, and it was like bald and shiny, and now it's growing back, so yeah. And I applied Jamaican Black Castor Oil to my scalp. And I picked up the hair food. It basically, it's like a mix of different creams and moisturizers. And you just put it on your scalp. Similar to the oil, but it's just easier to apply this. Um, I'm thinking about using this as a sealant to seal in my moisturizer. Um, we'll see. Yeah. But this was, I thought this was really neat. And I actually put this on Malachi's scalp, too. Because, you know, he was, um, had that eczema thing in the cradle cap really bad. So, yeah. And someone said that cradle cap, I mean, eczema comes from eating rice or dairy. I'm like, okay, um... I've, I've eaten it all my life, and I've never had eczema. So I guess it affects certain people. I don't know if it's necessarily something that you ingest that causes eczema. I think it's something you just have. So it's hereditary because I know my sister has it. Um, Omar doesn't have it. I never had eczema. Omar, Big Omar never had eczema. But two out of our four children had eczema, like, severely. So I don't know. Okay. I don't know. But I don't. What I've eaten with my first two kids never affected their skin. So I, I don't think it's something that is dairy or rice. Um, but I do put a lot of that in my regular diet, and I don't have eczema at all. So, yeah. I'm just saying, just put that out there. Okay. Um, because everybody is different. Then I placed the order for Commit Biologics. Let me just say, I don't know if the shipping has been $12 for the past three years, but that is absolutely ridiculous. $12 for shipping. Okay, whatever. So I pay my $12 shipping. And then, I picked up a few sample products. And I picked up the Olive and Honey Hydrating Balm. And I used this before, but it comes with a little pump now. And I thought this was really cute. I think it was like $4, which is fine for a sample. Okay. You know, whatever. Then I picked up another sample. It could have been $3. And this sample right here was $5 and $4.90. And it's the Ethiopica Hydrate and Twist Butter. Basically, it's like a twisting pomade. It smells really nice. It smells like candy. Um, this is my thumb, and this is, and this was four dollars and ninety cents. I was mad about it because I remember when I started shopping with them a long time ago that their samples were a good ounce or two. And I'm uh, looking at this like, I, you could have threw, whatever, girl. We'll see how it works. If it don't work good, I'm really gonna go in about this <laughs> spending five dollars with that little teeny bitty piece of uh, sample. But then I picked up the tea tree and grapeseed therapeutic pomade, and basically it's tea tree oil in a 
in a glaze. Um, teach your girl battles. It's like an antiseptic. It's really good for uh, eczema, dry skin, or whatnot. And with the weather change and my hormones, I know my notice that my scalp is a lot drier than it usually is. So I picked this up. I picked up the full size product. And it says like it's clear pomade and it goes on really smooth. And I put this on my scalp also. I alternate what I put on my scalp. I don't put all these on at one time. That's just not that's too much stuff on your hair. But and it smells like tea tree oil. So yeah. Um, I think I'm going to try this on my son's eczema a little bit and see if it clears that up a little bit. Because I know tea tree oil is really good for that. Now these two things are my absolute favorite. Um, these are definitely repurchases. Um, anytime I order from Comet Biologics, but it has been years because, like I said, the shipping is like $12, and their products range from like 12 like 8 to 16 to $20 for each different product, and it's like, you end up, I end up spending $70, including the $12 shipping, so come on, come on, that, that just discourages you from purchasing stuff from a website when it costs that much. For some hair products, you spent $70 on hair products, that's the question I got when it came in the mail, <laughs> $70? For some hair products. Yeah. I said, you know what? Don't trip on me because I do my own hair and I save you a couple of hundred dollars a month by doing my own hair. So you better get your life together, sir. Complaining to me about spending money. But yeah. <laughs> I digress. Let me talk about these products. So then I picked up the conditioner and it's the Coco Tree Detangling Gee. And this is a really thick pomade, which is, I was wondering why they put this in a pump. Because it's not pumping. It's really thick. And initially they had it in a jar. But this is thick. You see that? So I guess you got to heat it up a little bit. But I'm not going to heat this up. I'm, I just take it out and put it in the palm of my hand. You know, like that. But the pump doesn't really work for me. Okay. But this is the most amazing product to detangle your hair with. And um, I haven't been really detangling my hair with combs or brushes. More so just finger, finger detangling. But it smells really good. It smells like chocolate. And I can just smooth it on top of my hair and clean, um, smooth out any single strand knots or whatnot. And I love this. So this is definitely a repurchase. Um, and then I picked up my best, the best moisturizer ever to have graced my hair. And this is the Alma and Olive Heavy Cream. And this is for a thicker hair. They have the Burda Fruit Cream, which is a little lighter for um, finer textured hair. But this is the best moisturizer ever. And this is what I twisted my hair out with last night. And I got this braid out. And it's slightly defined. Slightly. Um, it was defined until I separated them apart. But yeah, this is my hair. And it moves. And it smells good. And it's soft. And like I said, I had heat damage years ago. Well, from last year because I did wear a sew-in. And so some of my ends are straight. So if you see these layered choppiness in my hair is because whenever I do a twist out I just go in and cut those straight pieces off and just leave it alone that's why I said for this next year I'm just focused on maintaining my natural hair in its natural state and styling it trying to grow it out and yeah that's basically it so that's my haul video for my hair products uh, thank you everyone for watching don't forget to follow me on Facebook um, Instagram Twitter uh, check out my blog yeah my, my blog and I also have a separate channel called mom stuff TV focus specifically on mom stuff um i have four boys um i'm breastfeeding i just had a baby my youngest is four months old my oldest is six and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video thank you for watching bye